In math, we are presented with a variety of problems. 1 plus 1 equals 2. Simple. But when it comes to relationships, 2 is company and 3 equals 1 big mess. Well, nice to meet you, Chris. <laughs> How do you uh, two know each other? Oh, Bryn and I used to... Uh, study together in college. Right. Uh, Bryn was my math tutor. Ah. Oh. You never told me you were a tutor. Uh, it was nothing, really. Oh, don't be <laughs> modest. She was the best in our class. I would have failed advanced trig if she hadn't taken me into her capable hands. <laughs> That's me. Bring to the rescue. Ah, and let me tell you, boy, was she passionate about her work. Ah. I mean, there were times that she would keep me up all night. Ah, well, that's my pumpkin. <laughs> Always dedicated to helping others excel. Anyway, uh, I just stopped by to congratulate her on her upcoming nuptials. <laughs> You're one lucky guy. Uh, well, I am indeed. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of guys from college would do anything to be in your shoes. Oh. Hell, I can name one right now. <laughs> You'd have to kill me first. <laughs> <laughs> I got a shotgun in the car. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll let you two uh, finish catching up, Bryn. Don't forget about the game. Be there or be squared. <laughs> Get it, Chris, squared. <laughs> what was that? Tell me that's not the guy you're about to marry. Where'd you find him at the National Nerd Association? Yes, he's the president. And he's more man than you ever were. <laughs> Carlton Banks is more man than me? I doubt that. Well, he is. He's thoughtful and considerate. He even came up with an algorithm to determine the best sexual positions in bed. You gotta love those algorithms. Well, I do. Daily. Now, if you'll excuse me. Are you happy? Happy? Of course I'm happy. He's perfect. We're perfect together. And you'll have perfect little kids running around with pocket protectors, solving quadratic equations, never confusing their binomials with their trinomials. I'm sorry. If you're happy, I'm happy. Well, I am. Thank you. Are we done? Brent, please. What do you want from me, Christopher? He, he wants, wants to be friends! friends. Is he crazy? Oh, I told him I'd think about it. Are you crazy? Everyone knows you can't be friends with your ex. I mean, once the relationship is over, you cut your losses, you cry your tears, and you move on. Like me. Aren't you still in therapy over Terry? Twice a week, and she still hasn't paid her bill. Having a friend that's a therapist should have its perks. Perk my ass, I want my money. The point is, you can't allow some man to just pop back in your life. I mean, who does he think he is? She's right. You're about to get married, and letting Christopher back into your life now will only complicate things. Does this dress make me look fat? <laughs> look, what you need to do is take back your power. Oh, here we go. Tyler and her black woman Napoleon complex. Angel, I thought you were working on this with her. We haven't gotten that far yet. She's got a lot of issues. A hey, lot. It is not my fault the people around me are intimidated by a powerful black woman. <laughs> you mean a crazy black woman. Did you find a new assistant yet? I don't need an assistant. They just get in the way. Funny, that's what you say about men. And that's why she doesn't have one. Hey, what <laughs> happened to doctor-patient confidentiality? Oh, that's for paying clients. Uh, Cut it out, you two. You're supposed to be helping me pick out a dress. It's part of your bridesmaid's duties, remember? Yeah, and yes. aren't we missing a bridesmaid? Where's Jessica? <laughs> Probably fighting for a cop down at the women's shelter. Uh, what? You know she don't pay her rent. <sighs> I got evicted. Again? Again? Told you. How many times do I have to tell you rent is not a suggested donation? She's not staying with me this time, so, uh, Bren... What? It, it's your turn. I have a wedding in a few months. Uh, Angela? What is this? Thanks! Nice to know I have the support of my friends. We love you. We do. Okay, but we cannot enable you. The only way for a little Robin to learn how to fly is if she's push. 
out of the nest. That's therapy talk for you're on your own. So, hi, Robin. Jessica. Antonio. It's always a pleasure. Bite me. Still feisty. I like that. 